Can I be honest with you? Please, please. Uh, I was uh, actually very reluctant to come on the show tonight. Um, I'll tell you why. I've been traveling quite a bit. I've been on a very, uh, very heavy schedule. And I think when you come on a show like this right. that reaches so many people, I think it's important... I think it's important to look your best. Of course. Right. And frankly, I was uh, concerned that I might have bags under my eyes. Well, luckily, if you had no... If you hadn't have brought it up, if you hadn't have brought it up, I don't think that people would have noticed. You know? <laughs> we all get those occasionally. Sometimes also, they get out of control. This is actually, this is actually good. If my eyes fall out, <laughs> then you catch them. Got them right in the bag. Can I take these off? No, now? you're stuck with them the whole show. <laughs> well, I'll take one off. Take okay. just one off until the crowd gets used to it. Ah, we put these on with crazy glue. <laughs> Oh, finally, I get rid of that stuff. <laughs> okay. You know, this is the uh, first time. Hi, Tommy. Hi. You, you know Tom, don't you? Yeah. Oh, yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> play tennis, we play bridge, we do the whole thing in bridge. <laughs> Close personal friend. This is the uh, first time. Is the tape on my face? Yeah. Um, I like that. Okay. <laughs> This is the first time I've... I've been on this show probably 60 or 65 Something times. Like that, yeah. I think so. And this is the first time I've ever been on this show and not done a monologue. And... That's probably true. Well, no. <laughs> okay, these two guys are walking down the street. And then... You see? <laughs> see, once you get real big, you see, and you're you as hot as you that. are, you walk right here and sit down You don't have to be funny That's anymore. You just you... come out and talk about your poodle. That's right. Um, <laughs> No, the, the reason I uh, didn't do a monologue, when I first started in show business about, it was about 15 years ago, I figured, I said, well, let's see, how many monologues will I need? So I said, well, probably 65. <laughs> so I wrote the 65 monologues, and then I did the 65 shows, and that was it. And, that's... and so now I've just got chit-chat. So you never thought it would uh, never thought it would go longer than 65 monologues, huh? No, I've got the chit-chat spots, though. Well, the chit-chat got... spots are good. You have to have that. And you're like, how are you doing? How do you like California more than New York? Those are always good, safe mm -hmm. questions, you know. And... I have 900 chit-chat spots all ready to go. <laughs> really? Yeah. What would you think about the rain, Johnny? That's that kind of stuff. I think that's, that's good. Yeah. You've been out for, was it right, what, 13 weeks? Or a 13 city tour? I don't know. Yeah. I have no idea. <laughs> now, after you get on a long tour after a while, you wake up and people go, where, where were you? And you go, huh? And, uh, so I don't know where I was. I, w I was in uh, Terre Haute, Indiana, Knoxville, Tennessee. Uh, what happened? I've gone crazy. I knew it would happen. <laughs> I forgot. What's happening? Things growing on the hands now also? No, I just look at my hands every once in a while. This is the latest album? Or is this not the first yeah. one? No, this that's the, the second latest, album. It? No, it was released four weeks ago. It escaped, actually. Yeah. Um, <laughs> You got, the, you got King Tut on here? King Tut is on there. Yeah, is that cell? Is that the cell? It's, um, it's number three this week. Uh, with a bullet? Or yeah. Is that, uh, is that what bullet, they call it? No. Yeah, that's what they do with the, with the music. They say with a bullet, which I guess is uh, the best you can get. It's got a bullet. and what, uh, what would be the price of this album if I walked in the store and wished to purchase this? If you walked in? Sure. I'd probably give you one. No, 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 no. I, <laughs> I, I never ask. I always think it's better yeah. to buy it. Yeah, I, I agree. And, uh, uh, it's uh, retail eight ninety five, but usually stores mark it down a little bit. Wow. You get rich from something like this, can't you? No. <laughs> <laughs> well, you've made a... Can I ask you a personal question? You don't sure. have to answer this if you don't want to. Okay. You've made a lot of money in the past year. I How mean, do you know that? Thing? Well, I... <laughs> but I have expenses. You know, I've got the arrow. That's right. Well, you can... You can... That's not ever thought about that, and... Now, balloons aren't what they used to be. They're I know. going Sometimes up. I'll be doing a show, a balloon will just pop, or a, <laughs> two balloons will pop, and there's expense. And there goes your whole week's salary. And then my it. arrows, of course, are uh, the professional model. They're, uh, <laughs> they're made in Germany. They cost $150 a piece. So, uh, <laughs> you're going to write that off then, huh? Oh, you deduct that, sure. Didn't you have on one of your albums, wasn't there a... Didn't you have a message in a paper or something to call a number? What was that? Uh, that was an ad... Uh, for this album, and uh, they put an 800 number, which is a toll-free number, and you can call in and... And said, talk to Steve, right? Yeah, and it would, it would talk to me, and then I would give a little funny talk. It you had a, a recording? Promotional 
device. And uh, I think Saturday they got 100,000 phone calls. And, uh, you know, my hand got so tired <laughs> from... Hello, this see, most people would think it was a recording, you see, but you oh, actually no, I, were there I at home. I think that's cheating. I really do. I wouldn't do that. <laughs> Did the phone, but doesn't the phone company get money when somebody makes those calls? Sure. I don't know. Do they? Yeah. Why would they want to discontinue that? Need an album. What? They want the album. They want the album. <laughs> well, Eight ninety-five. The phone company got enough money; they can buy it themselves. All right. Yeah. <laughs> we will. Uh, we're gonna take a break here, and then we're gonna come back. You're gonna stay, right? Oh, oh yeah. Well, sure. Okay. We'll do this. We'll be right back. I think it's just important. I, I've examined my own life because when something like this happens, it's bound to affect you, and I, I feel that I have really remain the same as I was three or four years ago. I've always been pompous, conceited, uh, <laughs> egocentric, so nothing has changed really for me. And as they say, they make, you meet the same people on the way up as you do on the way out. There's something like that. It's yeah. a, a different version, but I can't remember what it was. <laughs> Somebody told me now, I did, when they tell you these things, you don't know whether you, I'm, you're putting me on or not, but you are interested in astronomy, not astrology, astronomy. Astronomy. Well, I know you have an interest in astronomy. Oh, yeah, yeah. Right? yeah. Not astrology. Yeah, astronomy. Right. Astronomy. <laughs> and, um, see, I'm trying to take a Well, look. a lot of people, as soon as you say astronomy, they say, oh, yes, yeah, I'm, I'm under Leo, Capricorn, right? and they, under, they misunderstand. Uh, I'm a feces, so that's my whole sign. A feces? <laughs> that's right behind the sign of the ram, isn't it? There's something like that? Yeah. Uh, new sign for me. I'm not familiar with that. No, I read in Time magazine that uh, this was in the science section. You really? You that really it, that. You read those little parts too? Yes, I. I read in Time magazine. I know that changes a lot of opinions about me. You probably thought I was a fool who never read. Well, I did read Time magazine. Thank you. Um, so you're, you're deeper than you appear. Yeah, that's right. Obviously. I read in Time magazine that at any moment the sun could expand and completely engulf the Earth and destroy it. And when I read that, I said, and I said, that's it. I'm getting a smoke detector. <laughs> See, that shows that you're up on things like yeah. that. Mm. It will, but it probably won't happen for a couple of billion years yet. A couple of billion years? A couple of billion years. <sighs> what the hell, who cares? Who cares yeah, I'll, I'll probably be dead then anyway. Probably. <laughs> You want to talk about your, uh, this special you have sure. tomorrow? I suppose that's the only reason you're really here. No, 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 no. It's the only no. reason anybody comes on this show is no. to plug something, no, come albums. Come on, on uh... I wanted to plug the album, too. Oh, uh, that's right. That's right. That's right. <laughs> I thought you were just being mercenary. Uh, did you enjoy it? This is your first special. Oh, it was, right? uh, it was a real adventure. You know, usually most specials are shot in three days. Right. Go into a studio and shoot it. And this one we shot in eight weeks. <laughs> and, um... Couldn't you learn your lines or what? <laughs> It was, uh, it's part film and part, <laughs> I almost did a, what do they call that? A Juxtaposition? Juxtaposition. Uh, uh, where am I? I'm right here. Okay, no, right I'm here. sorry. Terre Haute, Terre Haute, second show. I'm in Terre Haute and it's a second show. Um, this one uh, is part film and part videotape. So it's part my act and then part of it is my thoughts as we, uh, while I'm doing my act. You see, a stream of it's taken... Yes, that's right. And uh, I think we have a little clip, don't we? Uh, we lost it this afternoon. <laughs> we were going to show it, but I said, they said, no, we lost it. No, we have it. Of course, I'm, I'm so joshing. Which this I is just a little uh, clip. It probably just stands on its own. Uh, I don't have to explain it, except that Martha comes home after a long day's work. Her husband is married. With that's right. Husband. And the dog. Is you Ray? Yeah. Hi, I'm Steve. I'm the guy who called. Right, yeah. I'm in town just for the day. I need a car real fast and uh, saw your ad. How much, uh, how much are you asking for it? Uh, 1800 Starting at 18 Yeah, starting. How come you're selling it? Oh, I'm moving to Paris. Yeah. Let's sit here, I guess, right? Yeah. <laughs> well, it looks pretty good. Got good rubber on it. It's like new. Yeah. It's nice chrome. You don't see chrome like that around L.A. much. Nah. You know you got a dent here? Yeah, it's from a parking lot. Yeah, that lowers the value. So you're asking 18, it's got a dent, you know? I'll go 1,600. Okay. See, I don't make the rules, you know? Because they had one downtown just like this. They're asking 18, but no dent. So that's the way it goes. <laughs> How's the hood? It's original. It's got a good hood on it. Ray. Ray, Ray, Ray. Let me ask 
you a question. How's the radio? It's good. It's a good radio? Okay, I think we got a deal. <laughs> That's a genuinely funny idea. Well, thank you. That's that is very funny. Just a little tiny part of an hour special. <laughs> you have you have guests on the show, big big names. I suppose um, we can look forward to because you always have to have big. Well, names. we have some minor so, names: Bob Hope, Bob Hope, and uh, Milton Berle, George Burns, Johnny Cash, and uh, Strother Martin. Oh yeah, that's a good fine the actor. Actor Strother Martin. Fine actor. And uh, it's a you know I don't want to spill it all, so I don't. Well, of course not. That's why we just wanted to show. Except it. there's this one part for this guy. <laughs> You don't sing or dance or anything like that. Just no. go out and do crazy. Oh, yeah, no, I do. I do a little singing and dancing. Yeah. You know, I saw that movie, The Wiz. Yeah. God, I was so relieved. I thought it was about going to the bathroom. <laughs> Your fears are all were unfounded. Yeah, it yeah. Was, it's a family kind of movie. Yeah. Well, look, I would wish you good luck on the special. I understand that you have to leave. Uh, yeah, I have, have to, to go. be somewhere this evening and go. Uh, I have to rehearse. Uh, I know. Rehearse. Look, you're, I know you're doing a movie. Yeah. Yeah. Carl Reiner directing, too. Yeah, that's good. That's pretty that's good. That's good. We can talk about that the next time you come. Yeah. Out. Okay? I appreciate Thanks it. For being Thank here. you very much. Thank you. Funny. Funny guy. Steve Martin. I don't have to leave. Come on, they always have to leave. I just thought I'd say I had to leave, but I don't have to leave. That's all right. You can say it all right. That's all right. I understand. I understand. Can, can you stay a little while with us? Uh -huh. Oh, okay. <laughs> no, I, I, I can stay the whole I, show I, I, a little I, bit longer. I, 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 Okay, maybe right from here you can write on Tom Snyder. Okay. You know, you can go right there. Yeah. I know how you feel. Thank you. That's, that's sweet of you. We'll, we'll do this. We'll be right back. You'll still be here. Okay, don't leave him. Y'all calm down now? I'm okay now. Okay. Stay the whole show. Okay. All right. Because here's a gentleman that has been one of my favorite actors. You all want to uh, point out something? We're talking with Steve Martin, Tony Quinn. Is the Children of Sanchez open yet around the country? No, 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 no. It opens tomorrow. As a matter of fact, just for one week. And uh, then it opens uh, in February. Look, I hope it's a big smash for you, and I thank you for coming tonight. Thank you, Tony. Thank you. Thank you. A gentleman now who has been on the show many... Don't you? No. You don't have any place to go with him? Can I speak? Sure. <laughs> uh, 
I was sorry. Tony didn't have any place to go either, and I... I just figured you would be out doing another interview, plugging the picture, but uh, you, yeah. please stay. Uh, I didn't mean to hurt your feelings, Tony. Uh, <laughs> Can you stay the whole show? Uh, yeah, I'll stay. Good, well. okay. <laughs> Funny thing is, I have some place to go, and I gotta stay. Paul, Paul, we 